Okay, guys. I just have to get one more rat out. Okay, it is fucking midnight. It, it is midnight. I am completely fucking exhausted. I have had two stiff margaritas. I am a 62-year-old clueless moron. And I am standing on my left leg holding a heavy computer reading this article. Whoa, fuck! Did I make it 10 seconds? All right, we're gonna stand on the right leg. I am standing on a, all right, my living room slopes like a fucking, all right, my living room slopes like a fucking bowling alley. I've got three levels of uneven carpet. My goddamn pants are falling down. I'm 62 years old. I should have been asleep two hours ago. I have had two strong drinks. We're going to start this again. All right. We're going to stand on the right leg this time. We're going to see how long it is before I die. All right. Standing on my right leg, I'm going to get all the way on my new carpet, my new $10 carpet from Habitat for Humanity. Okay, on the right leg. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> I don't know, guys. I could be dead by tomorrow. All right, we're going to take three. We're going to go back to the left leg, holding a heavy computer, holding a heavy computer, trying to read two stiff drinks, dead tired at midnight, your 62-year-old man is going to take the test why simply standing on one leg can tell you whether your life, ah, shit, did I make it for 10 seconds again? All right. I can't get through the title of this thing. All right. We're going to one more time. All right. One more time. We're going to get way back here on the original carpet, so I'm not standing on three levels of carpet. Okay. 62-year-old man, two stiff drinks, dead tired, midnight at night, holding a heavy computer. We're going to take the test one more time. All right. Five, four, three, two, one. It is Tuesday, June 21st, 2022. Okay. Is this take three or four? Why simply standing on one leg can tell you whether your life is in the balance. Okay. Now I've got to get my damn computer to fucking scroll down. It's the computer. God damn it. Okay. Well, guys, the problem is the heavy computer. It's not the drinks. It's not the 62 years old. It's not... I did this fine until I picked up this 500-pound computer. All right. Take five. Why simply standing on one leg can tell you whether your life is in the balance. Oh, fuck. Okay. Guys, it's all about the computer. We're going to have to put the computer on the table here. All right. Take six. Not holding a 500-pound computer. All right. Let me pull my britches. Plus, my pants are falling down. Why simply standing on one leg can tell you whether your life is in the balance. The inability to stand on one leg for 10 seconds after the age of 50 could indicate an early death is on the horizon, new research suggests. Researchers found that people who failed the simple balance test had 
double the risk of dying from any cause in the next 10 years. Nearly one in six of the poor balancers died within a decade, the study reported, compared to just one in 22 of those who passed the test. The experts made allowances for other conditions that can influence the ability to balance, such as ill health or obesity, and found that even when those factors were taken into account, inability to complete the task raised the risk of death by 84%. God damn it. One leg standing time is a measure of posture instability, which some experts believe might go deeper than physical strength and actually be the consequence of the presence of brain issues, although private health care providers often include balance checks and routine health tests. Researchers say it should be used more widely. The author of the study said, quote, the 10 second balance test provides rapid and objective feedback for the patient and health professionals regarding static balance. The test adds useful information regarding mortality risk in middle-aged and older men and women. Unlike aerobic fitness and muscle strength and flexibility, balance tends to be reasonably well preserved until people reach their 60s when it starts to wane relatively rapidly. One of the reasons balance tests are not more widely used is because there have been few studies linking performance to health outcomes. Yes, for the current study, 1,702 participants aged 51 to 75 were asked to undertake a balance test and then monitored between February 2009 and December 2020. Around one in five failed to stand on one leg for 10 fucking seconds with the inability to do more or less doubling every increase in five years of age. Yes, while just 5% of the 51 to 55 year olds could not manage the test, more than a third of the 66 to 70 year olds could do it. In general, those who failed the test had poorer health, a higher proportion were obese and or had heart diseases, high blood pressure, and unhealthy blood fat profiles, and type 2 diabetes was three times as common in the failure group. However, after accounting for age, sex, and underlying conditions, an inability to stand unsupported on one leg for 10 seconds with a near doubling risk of death in the next decade, previous studies have shown that an inability to stand on one leg for more than 20 seconds is associated with microbleeds and silent strokes. There you go. Well, as much as I hate to say it, I guess I'm not going to die in the next 10 years. Jesus fucking Christ. Well, that was tough. Oh. Anyway, guys, get out there and enjoy standing on one leg. Well, you still can, but I'm going to get the hell out to my trailer and 
I'm going to stand on no legs and get horizontal while I still can. Bye, guys.